Hey guys, what's up? I am back with a brand new video and it's time to do a check out the performance of the Infinix Note 11 against the Redmi Note 10 and the Redmi Note 10 is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 678 processor with a 4 GPU of RAM while the Infinix Note 11 is powered by a Mediatek Helio G88 chipset with a 4 GPU of RAM on the back. We have quad cameras on the Redmi Note 10 versus the triple cameras on the Infinix Note 11. We have a 50 megapixel main camera f1.6 aperture while on the Redmi, we have a 48 megapixel main camera f1.8 aperture. Also, the pack is made up of plastic on both phones, and the frame on both phones also is made up of plastic. And both phones also has a side more fingerprint scanner, and the sides on the Infinix Note 11 is more flat. While on the Redmi Note 10, we have a rounded, and the Infinix Note 11 sides it feels more premium as compared to the Redmi Note 10. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how much the difference between the Infinix Note 11 versus the Redmi Note 10 in app's opening speed as well as in the boot up test. So without any wasting time, let's get right into it. Now let's see the boot up test. Here we go. Like always, and the logo is came up first on the Redmi Note 10 as compared to the Infinix Note 11. Also we have Android 11 on both phones. We have MIUI version 12.5 versus the XOS version 10 latest on the Infinix Note 11 and the Redmi Note 10 it is more faster when it comes to booting up while the Infinix now it is also done and you can see about one or two second difference there between these two devices now let's talk about the displays between these two devices we have a 6.7 inch full HD AMOLED display with 60 Hz refresh rate while on the Redmi Note 10, we also have a 6.4 inch Full HD AMOLED display with 60 Hz refresh rate. And the Redmi Note 10 also has a punch hole on the center as compared to Q shaped notch on the Infinix Note 11. Now let's see app's opening speed. And guys, everything's closed up in the background. No application is running in the background. Also, we have same Wi Fi network on both phones. Now let's see phone dialer. That is exactly the same on both phones. Again, we have different animation on both phones. Now let's see settings that it's also exactly the same. Now let's go to the display and you can see we have a new XOS on the Infinix which looks much better as compared to before. We have 60 Hz refresh rate, no higher refresh rate display. Now let's see Amazon shopping launching at the same time. Again we have a Snapdragon 678 versus a Mediatek Helio G88 exactly the same on both phones. Let's see the scrolling. Again, exactly the same, no lag whatsoever. Now let's see some games application. Now let's see Candy Crush Sega. Exactly the same on both phones. And both phones also has the speakers. Here is the speakers of the Infinix Note 11. And you can see we have a door speaker and a second speaker. It is inside the earpiece. So here is the Redmi Note 10 Max volume. And guys, I feel that in the speakers it is a little bit more bassier on the Infinix Note 11. Now let's see Instagram. That is faster on the Redmi Note 10. Let's see pin out. Little bit more faster on the Redmi Note 10 as compared to the Infinix Note 11. Now let's see, let's see Snapchat. That is exactly the same. Now let's see Spotify and the Spotify. A little more faster on the Infinix Note 11. Now let's see Subwoofer, and the Subwoofer should be more faster on the Redmi Note 10. Yes, it is more faster there, but you can see exactly the same on both phones at the end. Now let's see Temper and 2 on both phones. And the Temper and 2 faster on the Redmi Note 10. And you can see we see a little bit lag on the Infinix Note 11, but Redmi Note 10 is more faster there. Now let's open the PUBG Mobile on both phones. And you can see Infinix is taking a lot of time. But let's see which one is faster. Again, we have a Snapdragon 678 versus a Mediatek Helio G88 
faster on the Redmi Note 10 as compared to the Infinix Note 11 about about one second difference there now let's opening up the tutor and it and tutor faster on the Redmi Note 10 now let's open Zedge and the Zedge faster again on the Redmi Note 10 as compared to the Infinix Note 11 now let's see the scrolling and no issue whatsoever again we have 60 hertz refresh rate no high refresh rate display and last time we're launching the cameras on both phones default camera application let's see which one is more faster there faster on the infinix as compared to the redmi also we have ultra violence on the redmi note 10 which is not really available on the infinix note 11 now let's see internet phone speed i am seeing for google chrome on both phones also we have same wi-fi network as well now let's see wikipedia.org that is a little bit more faster on the redmi note 10 now let's see the scrolling in the start i see a little bit lag again exactly the same on both phones we have 60 hertz refresh rate now let's open this english exactly the same again now we see a little bit lag on both phones but you can see after one second it is also exactly the same i mean it is very smooth on both phones after one second again i see a little bit lag on the infinix because the processor of the infinix note 11 is not really powerful next on the list is the apple.com apple.com it is here exactly the same now let's see the scrolling again no issue whatsoever 60 hertz refresh rate and i am a 120 hertz user so i can see the difference very easily now let's see ram management on both phones and both phones has a 4 gp of ram now let's see that who is performed good in the ram management and you can see and the infinix automatically remove apps in the background now let's see phone dialer on the redmi note 10 it is no refresh now let's see settings no refresh Amazon shopping and that card refresh. Let's see Candy Quest Sega. Refresh. Instagram. Seems like refresh. Let's see Pinout. Refresh. Now let's see. Let's see Snapchat. That is no refresh. Now let's see Spotify. That is refresh, I think. In app refresh. Let's see Subwoofer. Refresh. Let's see Tampa Run 2. Again, same result. Now let's see PUBG Mobile. That is only refresh on the Redmi Note 10. And the Redmi Note 10 is taking a lot of time. Now let's opening up the tutor. And the tutor it is not refresh. Now let's see Zedge. And the Zedge it is also no refresh. Last way back to the internet browser. And that is only refresh on the Redmi Note 10. And guys, over I have to say regarding the app's opening speed, as you can see that and the Redmi Note 10 is performed more faster as compared to the Infinix Note 11. In the game app loading time, I would say that in system-based application, both phones is performed very similar. And yes, at the processor of the Infinix Note 11, it is not as fast. In terms of the RAM wise, I would say that both phones is performed really bad in the RAM management. I hope the RAM management will fix with some software updates in the future. And thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the Infinix Note 11 versus the Redmi Note 10. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos and follow me on Instagram and Twitter as well. And I will see you in my next video. Peace out.